What's going on everyone? My name is Sam Elkins. I'm a photographer and filmmaker based here in Los Angeles, California. Today we're going to be looking at Premiere Rush and specifically editing an entire sequence on your mobile device. So basically we're going to edit the video, we're going to post it to my Instagram story that drives traffic to my YouTube channel. And the cool thing is, is this actually all, you know, is all encompassing of my brand as a whole. You know, I do photography, I do video for a living, and all these things are super important to me, but even more important than that is keeping your brand very consistent. And the cool thing about this, you know, even something as simple as adding titles and adding uh, color, adding audio, all that stuff is so important to your brand and people really notice those little things. Um, and you can do a lot of those things using Premiere Rush. So that's what we're gonna be focusing on today, using those little things and kind of showing you how to tweak each one to, um, to stay true to your brand. Um, so without further ado, let's get into it. So now here we are in the timeline. I have opened everything up. I have about five clips in here that I'm gonna be using for this Japan Instagram story kind of teaser. Uh, but now here what I've done is we're going to work on a title. So the cool thing about title and even like fonts in general is that it's actually really important to your brand. Um, the important thing about fonts is that it's usually the same throughout, you know, even in all of my thumbnails and everything on YouTube, I use pretty much the same font, which is Avenir. I think it just looks really pretty. So what we're going to do here is just type in, I'm just going to do Japan right here. And the cool thing is you can move it around, just kind of adjust it however you like. Okay, so moving on now to color. And I think color is probably one of the more important parts of this. For me, it's a very important part of my personal brand. Um, I think color is like a really easy way to honestly define your brand. Uh, I think for me, I try to use the same colors throughout all of my photos and videos, and even Instagram stories as well. You know, I want it all to be all encompassing of like what I am as a brand and like what colors I've decided to showcase uh, to use for my brand. So for you, I would definitely encourage to find a color palette or even like a style of shooting, stuff like that, that is very you know important to your brand. Um, and now what we're gonna do now though is edit this footage within Premiere Rush using the colors. And the cool thing is now is what we can do is create a preset within Premiere Rush. Even for something as simple as an Instagram story, this is very important because it keeps your video very consistent, you know, even the look and feel throughout the whole entire video, even if it's 15 seconds, looks the same. And that's what's really important. And now lastly, we're just going to choose between our different orientations. The cool thing about Premiere Rush is you have landscape, portrait, and square orientations. So for this being an Instagram story, we're going to choose portrait. Um, and that automatically, you just click on it, and you're good to go. It makes it just perfect orientation to share onto an Instagram story. And now, literally all we do is click export button up here, and hit export. And while it's rendering out now, that's all we do. So. Nice and easy. Uh, I just like want to one more time reiterate like how important these little things are as far as like titles go, color, even something as simple as just trimming all of your clips up so that it just it just looks nice. You know, you want to you want to do all that throughout all of your content that you're creating. You know, whether that be photos or videos or whatever it may have you. It's all super important that you pick the same things and stay consistent throughout all of your different types of content you're creating. Even stuff as simple as titles and color uh, can really help with that. So thanks so much for watching guys. We'll see you in the next one.